A little less than a century ago, the aeroplane was invented, changing forever our airspace and the way we travel. With aircraft and air travel, we gain quick and easy access to our destinations. Today, millions of travelers fly across the skies on business trips and on holidays. In addition, millions of tons of cargo move across the globe. The result? Aeroplanes, airfields, airports, movement of people and cargo, and manpower and equipment. This requires efficient management and organization. To achieve efficiency and safety and to regulate aviation industry within Malaysian airspace, this is the jurisdiction of the Department of Civil Aviation Malaysia or DCA Malaysia, a department under the Ministry of Transport Malaysia. Air travel connects the world. However, there are no highways as we know them in the skies. Instead, there are airways or air routes. Each aircraft that flies has its own dedicated airway. Airways are invisible to the naked eye, but they are there. Without them, the skies would be chaotic. No one and nothing would reach its destination. The Malaysian airspace is controlled by the DCA, the watchful eyes and ears that govern all flights in Malaysian skies. The primary function of DCA is thus to ensure every flight within Malaysian airspace is safe, orderly and expeditious. Working behind the scenes, DCA monitors and tracks all civil, commercial, private and other flights, ensuring that aircraft stay on their assigned routes and at the correct altitude as well as airworthy to fly. DCA is committed to progress through extending professionalism level with the enhancement of knowledge and technological advancement. The best is done to ascertain that everyone within the aviation industry is diligent, dedicated and performs the best in order to achieve zero error operations at all times. DCA's vision towards safer skies Headed by the Director General, DCA comprises nine divisions, each with specific roles, working together to ensure safe, orderly and expeditious flights and to contribute to the nation's progress under the frameworks of Civil Aviation Act CAA 1969 Civil Aviation Regulation CAR 1996 Aviation Offences Act 1984 Airport and Aviation Services Operating Company Carriage by Air Act 1974 International Civil Aviation Organization or ICAO Annexes The Airworthiness Division This division is responsible for The registration of all civil aircraft The certification of aircraft standards The licensing of aircraft maintenance engineers The approval of organizations for the maintenance of aircraft and equipment The certification of aircraft manufacturers And aircraft accident investigations The Flight Operations Division The scope of this division encompasses The licensing of pilots and operating crew The certification of air operators And aircraft accident investigations The Air Traffic Services Division The Air Traffic Services Division is concerned with the provision of air traffic services and control The availability of search and rescue services The provision of aeronautical information services 
the establishment and maintenance of aeronautical fixed and mobile telecommunications, the exchange of flight information domestically and internationally, and the provision of navigational aids and aeronautical telecommunications. The Flight Calibration Division This division's work scope covers the calibration of air navigation facilities, the maintenance of aircraft and certification of navigational equipment, and the construction of flight procedures. The Airport Standards Division The Division of Airport Standards is responsible for Aerodrome Certification Aerodrome Operator Licensing Aerodrome Development Obstacle Denotation Approval Communication Navigation Surveillance or CNS Performance Verification and Aerodrome Operations Advice The Air Transport Division This division's responsibilities include Flight Schedule Approval Charter and Extra Flights Approval The Issuance of Air Service Licenses or ASLs and Air Service Permits or ASPs The Provision of Flight Approval for Diplomatic and Overflights and Coordination with International Agencies, for example the International Civil Aviation Organization, or ICAO, and the International Air Transport Association, or IATA. The Aviation Security Division. The Aviation Security Division deals with the development of policies and standards in aviation security. Ensuring compliance with standards of airport security. Ensuring compliance with standards of airline security. Ensuring compliance with standards of vital installation security. And the approval of permits for the transportation of dangerous goods. The ATS Inspectorate Division. This division's work scope covers Air Traffic Controller or ATC examinations ATC licensing ATC medical examination and ATC and equipment audit The Management and Finance Division is responsible for The Management and Financial Control of DCA To ensure smooth operations The Department of Civil Aviation Malaysia Working towards safer skies and ensuring that every flight within the Malaysian airspace is safe, orderly and expeditious.